Hi guys, uh, this is a short uh, video of uh, how you would do a software update uh, with the new flow. So uh, since the version of uh, the bike 3. Point something, uh, we are introducing a new flow uh, that will enable you to update the bike directly from your mobile phone without the need to do anything on the bike or any configurations there. So basically, uh, once the software update is available uh, for your bike version, uh, you will automatically get, get notified through the application. So you will see this screen uh, pop up when you open the applications, uh, application and from here you can start the procedure. Basically you tap here and you go into the software update screen where you can start the process so it's it's a on the mobile phone it's a three-step process first you download the uh, software update file to your mobile phone then you uh, push it to the bike from your mobile phone to the bike and then the bike will uh, automatically apply it so we will start with a download uh, the app is asking you if you want to use the wireless or cellular data i'm just going to continue with cellular depending on the quality of your internet connection uh, it this can take up to a couple of seconds uh, up to then from 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 a couple of seconds up to two three minutes to download once the file is downloaded uh, you then get the screen uh, which uh, confirms that it's that it's ready and then you tap on the install update uh, it tries to connect your bike or wireless so you have to confirm it this is Android 11 device uh, it's now connected to your bike and bicycle goes into software update mode and it's receiving the file you just downloaded now it's receiving it from your mobile phone to the bike this will take around five minutes. Okay, so the upload is uh, coming to to uh, to an end. Uh, once it's uploaded, the bike will automatically go into the next step. So it will start flashing its uh, board, and you will see the status changing both on the mobile phone and on the bike itself. Uh, this part lasts around five minutes uh, and during that time uh, you don't have any actual progress uh, bar or, or progress in, uh, indication available but the bike is doing its thing and when it's end you'll get a you'll get a confirmation okay so this is a this is the end of the process uh, the bike is uh, up, successfully updated and it's going into reboot on the mobile phone you get this confirmation screen and while the bike reboots you can just tap and done uh, you see the software update state is still on the on the mobile phone but once the bike reboots uh, it will be uh, ready for for riding and it will have a new uh, software update applied thank you